controversial call there. Ball went out of bounds. Off of Nicola Melli, they had to review it. And now Boston Celtics have a chance to win the game after Lamella Ball made one or two free or one ball made one or two free throws. Tyson gonna inbound it. Back court to Tatum. Tatum's got heart on him. 12 seconds on the shot clock. Spin move. Tatum. Oh, nasty step back. He's got 30, 30 points for JT. Jason Tatum money. JT clutch. After an overturn call, they get the ball back and JT nails it. After Jalen Brown missed the layup, they get the ball back and it's a Jason Tatum show with 30 points for the night. Whoo! Ankles! And the 20, Zion's got 22 on 50% from the field. Solid game. The guys got 27. At the end of the day, could they pull out a big win here? I don't know. But JT says no. We're going to win this game. Spin. Hart, where are you going? Pull up in his eyes. Bang. Bang. Now Lonzo or Zion or B.I., one of those guys, maybe even Josh Hart, we're going to have a chance to win this game here. With eight seconds in the clock, Tatum's got 30 tonight. Jalen Brown only has, what, like 17, I think? Pretty inefficient. B.I.'s got 27. Zion's got 22. Lonzo's got like 15, I think, and Josh Hart hit a couple big shots, but he's been really inefficient down the stretch, and JT is hyped. They're going to go to 16 and 15. I think of, oh, they're going to go to 16 and 14 if they can win this game because they're 15 and 15 as of now. No, they're going to go 16 and 15. What am I saying? I think New Orleans' main guy is Zaya, or is um, B.I. on the last second opportunity, but... They don't really have a true closer. Like, it could be Zion, but it could also be B.I. I think B.I. is the guy as of now who is, should be their closer. Nicola Melli, and Nero Alonzo Ball will inbound. Nicola Melli and Josh Hart is in. B.I. and Zion is in. They're going to play for Zion. He gets the ball. Takes to the hoop over Tristan Thompson. Allen! Allen! Zion! Big body! Big body Zion! Over Tristan Thompson, the seven foot, seven footer. He just overpowers a seven foot, three hundred pounder with his six foot, seven, three hundred pound body. Zion Williamson, twenty four points, only four in the first half, but twenty here in the second half. And this might have won the game if he can hit a free throw. Hit him on a charger. He was clearing the restricted circle. Lonzo's loving it. Zion is absolutely hype. The Zion hype has died down a bit. Now it's on Lamelo, but Zion is still that guy. And to make it a two-point game. Wow. Um, who are the announcers? I can't really. I can't remember who's announcing, but he, the announcer just said that he missed the free throw. Who is that? Is that like Shaquille Griffin? I don't even know. Looks like him. Zion just maybe won this game for the Pelicans. After Tatum hit a huge shot. The kids are hype. The kids are hype. Oh, yes. It's going to be the JT show now. Here we go. It's going to be the JT show. Can he hit a game winner? There's Taco Fall on the sideline. Here's that play before. With the, with the spin and the step back. Bang. Jason Tatum. Zion overpowers Tristan Thompson, a defensive minded center. A seven foot. Actually, is it really defensive minded? I don't even know. A seven footer. 25 now after that free throw. Bray Ivan had 27. Uh, Jalen's got 20. Okay, pretty solid. And, um,. 13 in the fourth quarter is insane for Zion. And JT got 30, like I said, on 19 to the field. The fans here in New Orleans, let us see some fans in the stadium. Can't even watch that in Portland yet. Sucks to see. And here we go. JT to win the game right here, right now. They get it to him. Nearly goes back court. Josh Hart guarding him. Takes it to the hoop with the layup. Oh, Jason Tatum! Jason Tatum with the floater with 0.2 seconds to tie the game. Timeout, New Orleans. We're going to overtime unless you get a Zion tip. Jason 
This is a Jason Tatum takeover game I've been waiting for. This is the Boston Celtics that we thought we could see with Jason Tatum leading this team and Jalen Brown's that sidekick with Kevin Walker being pretty bad. This is the JT show. Two, one, floater. Bang. Paul can have 0.5 in the closet, it looks like. One of the toughest shots, like Doris Burke just said. Floater on the move from eight feet. Oh my goodness. I don't care how old he is. I just care how good he is, Doris. Jason Tatum. Absolute clutch. And we're going to overtime. Now we'll get you an overtime reaction once it happens, if it's a good game. Uh, maybe I'll give you anyway. Like the last, if it's bad, it's going to be the last 30 seconds. Tell you what happens. Jason Tatum. Money. That's what JT does. 32 points on 33s. Nine free throws. Missed two free throws. Amazing. I mean... I hate when people say that they miss free throws, so the game's over. Yeah, sure. In reality, if you make the free throws, they win by two, but it's a different completion in the game. Like, they don't really understand that. Then it's a different game the whole time. Like, I don't even know. Zion is in the game. Tip in. Jackson Hayes is in the game. Tip in. You got the big boys in the game to come in and get a tip in and win it. Maybe you get a lob. Jackson Hayes just puts it down. Zion, same thing. Inbounding is Lonzo Ball. He's known for those lob attempts. Here we go. Lonzo Ball. Throw it up, little fella. Daniel Tice nearly tips the ball into the hoop, and we're going overtime. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in overtime.